this is a quick tutorial showing you how to create layouts in XV Capture. Come to your desktop, find your XV Capture icon, right click, and go into the third option down, open file location, double clicking. And now we're going to make our way alphabetically to the progressions editor and double click on progressions editor. And here's where we create or edit our progressions or our layouts or formats. Upper left hand corner, let's click on create new progression. Let's call this one a four bite wings and two PAs. Upper left hand corner, add new shot. So this gives us our adult tooth charting. If we needed to create a chart uh, layout for deciduous teeth, come to tooth control and find the arrow down and you would select deciduous tooth charting and now we have our A to T. I'm going to create for adult bite wing, so I'm going to go into tooth control and go back into the adult tooth control. So for my first shot, let's do this posterior and we want to make sure that our sensor orientation is correct. This is the patient's right side, the top of the sensor, which is opposite the cord, if you're using a digital sensor, is the right side. We're doing the, the right side. So let's make sure we have that selected, how the sensor is going to be positioned, and then we're going to say, okay, upper left hand corner, add another shot. Let's highlight the teeth that will be in this image. Sensor orientation to the right, since it is the patient's right side and say, okay, my third shot, let's add a new shot. Highlight the teeth we want associated. The sensor orientation is now to the left and we say, okay, add another shot. My fourth shot would be my premolar bite wing. My sensor orientation to the left, it is the patient's left, say, okay. My fourth shot, my upper anterior teeth, highlight those teeth, and now the top of the sensor is pointing up into the palate, where you would say, okay, my, that was my fifth shot, let's add my sixth shot for lower anterior periapical, highlighting the teeth associated with that image. Orient your sen sensor, the top of it now is pointing down, and we say, okay. If we need to edit those shots, we can highlight the shot and edit and move these shots up and down if we need to rearrange the order. When I'm finished, I'm going to say, okay. And now I can close this application and close down. And when I'm opening the software and I'm in my capture mode, I should be able to find that layout easily. That four bite wings and two PAs here. Perfect. You see from moving from the patient's right, one, two, three, and four, upper anterior five and six. It's that simple to create the layout that you need, associate it with the teeth you need, choose your deciduous chart should you need, and order them as you wish. Closing that application, and when you open up XV Capture, your new layout will be available to you. Quick tutorial on creating progressions or layouts in XV Capture. Oh.